where does your faith truly lie? Because that determines the outcome of your existence. <laughs> What are, you, what are you doing? One last hand. There's, there's, no way to, there's no way to win. The cards don't care. She's my biggest fan. Can I ask you something? Can you remind me of how that feels? It's the best. Jeff. You may be disappointed in yourself, but don't throw away everything. Not everybody has that. I guess. But now, if you still want to die, I can tell my buddy upstairs you called him a pussy. And he will beat your face in with a baseball bat. But you don't want to do that. What you should do is buy your girl some flowers. Do that Sunday dinner with your family. And don't make a mistake. That'll ruin the rest of your life. All right, kid? No, no, no. Don't make excuses for me. Or for any man of that matter. Or for anyone you love. Male, female, binary. What's the new one? Transgender? Dead. Buddy, getting married is hard. Especially your first time. <laughs> now, you see, I've been married twice. So I can tell you, it's a lot easier your second time around. <laughs> I, uh, I talked to Alan about it, and I thought that maybe it'd be better if he walked me down the aisle instead. <laughs> now, I thought my joke was funny, but you, girl, <laughs> man, you're tripping right now. <laughs> Shut them up! Listen to them! Fuck you! Don't resist the You know, all right, underground! Do you have anyone you can call to pick you up? Or what about at least a place to stay the next couple of days till you figure out what you're going to do next? I guess I have a few numbers I could try. Okay, why don't you call one of them? Now? Yes. What's the worst that can happen? Anything in your pockets that could cut me or stick me? Yeah, I got Skittles in my back pocket. He's clean, Bang. Take it easy. Smart ass. You in the wrong neighborhood to be telling jokes. You didn't check these fucks before they came in here? You're making me look bad. This is extremely embarrassing, but please be assured, both of you, we run a professional game. And what happened here tonight? Well, that's very rare, and it won't happen again. <laughs> Just because I'm in here, that don't mean I don't know what's going on out in those streets. And just because you and I don't talk, well, that don't mean I don't know what's going on with you. You see, I know about the bag you're getting, how you're getting it, and where you're getting it from. Back to work? What's wrong, Pete? Mary, Rachel called. She doesn't want Junior to come over tomorrow. Or the next day, or the day after that, or the day after that. Wait, why? Why do you think, Mary? She's scared. 
She's afraid Junior's gonna get COVID-19. And what is this, pizza again? I mean, we barely get to see you as it is. So this is your idea now of quality family time, huh? Five minutes of pizza with DeAndre and me and then it's right back off to work? What do you want me to do, Peter? The coronavirus caused your wife to have a heart attack. No, you're wrong. You're, you're wrong, this, this, no, this couldn't have happened. This is a mistake. I'm very sorry for your loss. I don't believe it. I don't believe you. I need to see her. I need to see my wife. I understand how you feel, but because of COVID-19 and its transmission rate, we can't allow visitors to the hospital right now. I'm sorry. No, this is wrong. You can't do this. That's my wife, the mother of my children. We need to see her. We deserve to see her. I am so sorry for your loss, Mr. Hartz. Truly, I am. Take care of yourself, Peter. <laughs> Why couldn't they protect her? I thought she was safe. She helps everyone. Why couldn't you help her? Damn this coronavirus!